Hello guys, what is up? My name is Haley. if you are new here. I post fashion videos, beauty videos, unboxing videos, uh, but more fun content that is gonna be coming with pregnancy, all kinds of fun stuff. So hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of that stuff. And if you are not new here, welcome back. Thank you so much for checking out another video of mine. I do appreciate it so much. Um, so I do wanna go over again, just the new schedule that I will be doing for my videos, for my weekly uploads. So I'm gonna be posting two times a week and it will be on Tuesdays and Fridays. And those will be posted by 7 p.m. So, and that is Texas time, so I don't know I think it's like CDT. I don't know the time stuff or whatever, but that is Texas time. So Tuesdays and Fridays by 7 p.m. Those will be my regular upload dates or days, not dates. Um, then I'm coming up with a couple new things like series, I guess you could call them, challenges, whatever. One's a series, one's a challenge. Sure. Um, so I'm going to be doing a 100 days of makeup challenge. So I'm going to be posting short videos, um, four to five minutes long, of just a makeup look every day for a 100 days. So stay tuned for that because that is coming real soon. And then also I'm starting a new fun series. Um, I will be posting a video of that maybe once or twice once or twice a month, um, just depending, I guess, on how I'm feeling about it. Um, I'm really excited for this series. Um, it's something that I enjoy and I think a lot of my friends would enjoy too. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you do not miss all the fun things that are coming. So let's go ahead and get into today's video. So for today's video, I'm just doing my July BoxyCharm unboxing. I feel like this video is coming up a little bit later. I know that I got my box a little bit later than I normally do. So this is a little bit late, but better late than never. So here is July's BoxyCharm unboxing. So um, if you don't know what BoxyCharm is, it is a monthly makeup subscription box and they have different levels. You can get a base box, which is what I have, which is $25 a month. You can get a premium box, which is I think $35 a month, and then you can get Boxy Lux, and that is every three months for $50. And each box has a different value that it should have in the box. So with the base box, it is $25 a month, and there should be at least $125 worth of items in the box. And you will get five full size full size items in your base box. So let's go ahead and open it up. And right on top, they will normally have this little card and it, whoop, and it just has the items on the back and goes over them. And then it has a theme on it every month and July's theme is sunshine. So that is a cute little card. But let's go ahead and get into the box. And the first thing I am seeing is quick collar switch dry makeup brush cleaner. This is from Lavish. I've heard of this company. Um, I've never seen anything like this like a little sponge yeah I just did my makeup so let's test it out on okay so you can see well this might not come clean I need to clean my brushes really bad but I guess you just take it and squish it around in there well, I don't know <laughs> let's find a different one let's see I need to like deep clean my brushes. Okay, I just use this. You can see it's dusty and there's hair on it. Um, you can see it is full of makeup, it's dusty. So let's go ahead and try it out. I wonder if you eventually have to clean this though and if it like continues working like afterwards. Cause you can see like all the, like that went from dark black to like a light color now um it looks like it did a decent job i don't think it gets it extremely clean but i think the point of this is just like a quick 
like brush off real fast just so you can use the same brush but a different color so that is a cool concept let's see what it says about it it says with this quick color switch dry brush cleaner you can quickly remove powder pigment pigments from makeup brushes without water reusable and washable so yes i guess you can wash the thing on the inside and it will Yeah, you said it says simply wash with your favorite cleanser, allow to air dry, and return its the sponge to the container. So that is nice to have when you're doing your makeup and you don't want to dirty up a bunch of brushes. So you can just quickly clean off one brush that you're using and switch to the next color. So that is nice, and that retails for twenty dollars. So next product I see is is Hank and Henry. I really like the packaging. I love red. Um, on top it says sexed, so I don't know if that's the color. Um, it's a satin matte lipstick. Ooh. Ooh, this packaging. Oh my gosh, this packaging is so pretty. And then I guess you push it up, push it down. Oh, push it down. Okay, so you push it down and then that thing comes. Oh my goodness. What the heck? The outside of that so is so the outside of that is so pretty. Um I don't know. I don't think it'll be glittery. Hmm. Let's test it out. I'm gonna try it on. Okay, so I wiped my lipstick off real fast. I just had like a lip gloss on, so let's see. Oh, it's a nude. I was expecting it to be like a red or something. Hmm. That is really pretty. Um, with the glitter, I couldn't really tell exactly what color it would be, but I was expecting it to come out red, but it came out this nude color. It's really pretty though. And this packaging is so cool. So it has like this top part and you press it down and then the loop stick comes out of the bottom that is really cool i like that so it feels really good on the lips it doesn't feel drying or anything i'm gonna put a little lip gloss over it but i really like that color i just i'm more of a shiny gal i like lip gloss better than matte like a, a shiny lip gloss better than a matte color. I don't know if this color looks good on me. What do you guys think? Okay, anyways, so let's see what that retails for. So the Hank and Henry lipstick retails for $17. And the formula is smooth and leaves a creamy satin finish or a moisturizing cream finish. So yes, it does, without the lip gloss, it still felt moisturizing. Um, it didn't dry out the lips like mattes normally do on me. Like as soon as I put a matte lipstick or lip gloss on, I feel like it immediately like goes down into my lips and like just leaves a bunch of cracks and stuff and it just doesn't look good. But I actually really like this before I even put the lip gloss on over it. So, right. So next product we have Clean Skin Club with the Vitamin C Brightening Booster. I am getting more into skincare and I know vitamin C like brightens your skin, hence like the brightening booster. Um, so I think I do need that um, just because I have dark under circle, like under eye circles. And I even feel like when I put on makeup, you can still see it a little bit. Um, I think that's just like an insecurity of mine. Maybe that's why I feel like you can still see it, but um, I'm excited to try this out. Um, let's see, it says it is a watermelon, green tea, and pineapple. So, on here it says a powerful mix of pineapple, watermelon, and green tea extract come together to create the ultimate all in one serum. The vitamin C brightening booster brightens the complexion for glowing skin, protects against UV damage, and helps reduce. Um, signs of aging so this retails for $49.95 so 
says you just mix you can either mix three drops with your cream or serum and it can be applied in the evening and mornings or you can apply it as a serum and just apply three drops directly to the face and neck after cleansing so i am excited to try this out let's go ahead and open it up Ooh, i like the packaging that's pretty i'm a package person i think if the packaging is good on a product it brings people in more to want to buy the product at least it does with me so um this packaging is really pretty i like that a lot so hopefully the product works that's a a decent price on a product that's what it looks like Oh, it feels really soft. It's not sticky or anything. It just feels really soft. Um, so I'm excited to test that out and try that out. Um, you don't really know whether um, skincare products work for you until you try them out for like extended time. So I can just try it out like in a day or two, but I will let you guys know how that works out and if I like it. So the next product is the brow micro sculpting pencil and this is from hourglass i have heard of hourglass and i've heard it's a great company so i've never tried any of their products but this i think okay it's in warm brunette so one side comes with a spoolie and this Oh, it's a different shape than, I don't know if you can see, that, that did not work. Um, I don't know if you can see, like, it's not shaped like a normal eyebrow <clears throat> pencil shape. So that is different. We'll swatch the color real fast. The color looks like it'll match pretty good. So I'm excited to try that out and see how I like their products um, or this product. Not every product is always great from every company, but I've heard great things about Hourglass. So this thing says it's an ultra precise brow pencil design to impart the thinnest hair like strokes for a micro blade worthy effects without the blade. <clears throat> and this retails for $28. So I'm super excited to try that out. It is definitely um, a like really skinnier brow pencil than the other ones that I have. So I'm excited to try that out. So the last product, last but not least, is a palette. And that is from... Her, I guess I've never heard of that company <clears throat> and it is a festival palette <clears throat> excuse me I'm gonna go ahead and open it up the color it has the colors on the back on the packaging the packaging is really cute definitely looking festival like so let's open it up oh <laughs> these nails make everything harder but these my nails are still on from my last video they I think they turned out pretty great so i'm excited to do them again and i'll make another video go video if you guys like just comment below if you would like to see more nail videos okay here we go so this is the packaging on the palette itself and this is a 12 piece pressed pigment palette and it comes with a mirror which i always like and those are the colors so i feel like there's a variety of colors you have some neutrals and then you have some pops of color i really like this utopia that one right there and then electric that one's really pretty so i'm gonna swatch a few of these Ooh, they go really nice that one was Turn It Up. I like that color. And then Fantasy World. Ooh, that one's really pretty. 
then we'll do Utopia and Electric. That one's Utopia. That one's really pretty. I just okay. There we go. That one's really pretty. I don't feel like it's as pigmented as the other colors. Ooh, that blue is really really pretty. I like that a lot. Um, this palette looks really fun. I think I can get some good looks out of it. So I'm excited to test this out with some looks. I will use this in, um, I'm excited to uh, test this out with some looks. I'll use this in the 100 days of makeup one day and get a look from this. So that was the five items in my BoxyCharm for July. So I'm gonna add up all the prices um that this palette also retailed for 36 dollars so i'm gonna add up all the prices real fast just so i can tell you guys the value of my whole box for july and i'll be right back all right guys so i added up all of the products um value prices or how much they are how much they go for <laughs> in stores so I can't think. Pregnancy brain is killing me because I forget everything and I just can't think. So, and it's words and words and like, I just can't form sentences. I don't know what's going on, but well, I do pregnancy, but <laughs> anyways, so the value of this box should be at least 125 for the base box and the total value of this box this month was 150.95 so it was over the amount that it should be i am really liking all the products that i got this month i'm excited to use the palette and this lipstick is kind of growing on me i'm not sure how i feel about the color on me but i think it's really pretty so i might get more use out of it um so I'm really excited for these products just to test them out more and yeah, and see how they work and let you guys know how they work for me. So um, I will have my BoxyCharm link down below. So if you wanna check out BoxyCharm and get a subscription, you can, you just click that link and it'll take you right to their website. Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I appreciate you guys so much checking out another one. Give this video a big thumbs up. And again, don't forget, hit that subscribe button because I have a bunch more content coming that's going to be really fun and exciting. So hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of the future content that I have coming next. And I'll see you guys next time.